10 bucks says he's drunk. Yeah. 20 bucks says he's a rich guy who drives like a douchebag. License and registration. Yeah, uh, sort of jumped that red light back there. No harm. So have you been drinking tonight? No. I had a glass of wine a few hours ago. I'm fine. Turn off the ignition. Step out of the car, sir. Uh, look, uh, you probably don't recognize me. I I'm Mitch Carroll. You know who I am. Out of the vehicle, sir. Now. Build a hole for half a wine and dinner. Man, don't look like wine to me. Turn around, put your hands on the car. Oh, don't be ridiculous. That's not what. What are you doing? Come on. Carrying any drugs, weapons? Shove it. Central 39. Adam, we got one under for DWI at Greenwich and Murray. Requesting supervisor on scene. 10 4 supervisor en route. Mr. Carroll, I'm Detective Cassidy. Why don't you look, take a seat? Take the cuffs off and let me out of this godforsaken rat's nest, damn it. You don't have the warrants to hold me. You blew a point one three. You've been placed under arrest for DWI. Screw you, sugar tits. I have powerful friends who will crucify you and your people for even putting your hands on me. Can you hear that behind the mirror? Look, you don't have a scratch on you, so that's someone else's blood you're wearing. Now, if that person is hurt and needs medical attention, we need to know now. If there has been an accident... Are you a Jew? You... You're a Jew, right? I should have known they'd stick me in a room with a Jew cop. I'm not talking to a Jew. I know the law as good as any. Does he know he has a right to remain silent? I'm Mirandizing him myself. Maybe. I am going to personally destroy you. Your sad little world's turning to shambles. Because I'm going to have you fired. And fired and tossed out on your ass. Jew cop. Make sure you write down everything he says. Whatever happened last night went down after you left the bar. And I told you I don't remember. You called home three times, which hit three cell towers around the city, which means you drove around Manhattan for an hour and a half before the police stopped you. Now, you must have been doing something. What is this? I mean, why don't you people believe me? I told you I don't remember a thing about last night, damn it. Are you just saying that because you don't want to talk to a Jew cop? What? Detective Sugar Tits? Jews control the world? Did any of that ring a bell? I never said those things. She's Irish, by the way, in case you want to get something else off your chest. <sighs> Well, alcohol, you know, uh, I, I get insomnia from alcohol. Maybe I, I, I took a, a sleeping pill on the way home. I left the bar. I, I woke up in jail. No, he slept through the whole thing. I do not remember a thing about last night, I swear. Now, I think it's time that I spoke with my attorney. The lieutenant says somebody called him. The DOA is a female, white, single gunshot wound to the neck, through and through. No round, no shells. Look like a dump job? Good guess. How'd you know? A suspect's phone hit a cell tower about four blocks from here. Who called it in? A couple of sanitation workers. Wow, well, there's not a whole lot of blood on the ground. She was definitely dumped. No ID, no purse, clothing's intact. They tried to make it look like it was a robbery. You find a bloody sheet around here, like something she was wrapped in? Egyptian cotton. I could count. The stuff beneath the sofa. I already vouchered it. Found this in the dumpster over there. Cash, credit card's still here. Danielle Hertzberg. She's Jewish. <laughs> 